another vlogtober vlog it is day 16 and i literally just finished exporting or editing it's now exporting um yesterday's vlog and it is like three o'clock right now so we're getting a little bit of a late start to uploading yesterday's vlog and to starting this vlog so i apologize but you guys have seen a few clips of me working this morning i really didn't want this vlog to be solely another work vlog because i am uploading a two-day one um yesterday and then this one will be going up today and I didn't want it to be like a bunch of work vlogs so I just filmed a little bit of me working and then we're going to be doing something pretty fun a little bit later today once I tidy up a little bit I'll actually do a little bit of cleaning so it might be a little bit of a clean with me slash getting our guest bedroom prepared which is fun because we are having our first guests over this weekend you guys have already um, met them Tom and Asha are our friends and they are actually staying in our guest bedroom first guests this weekend it's going to be a fun time we're going to a pumpkin patch we're going to be playing board games making food it's going to be great so basically I need to prepare the guest bedroom for them I need to change the sheets I need to clean up the guest bedroom has kind of become a little bit of a storage room for my like office and stuff so I need to clean up all of that we need to clean the bathroom. I'm going to be making a little welcome basket because I'm a nerd like that, but I've been waiting so long for us to have our first guests, so I'm super excited just to like make it the best thing ever. So we're gonna be doing that and that's going to be the main thing of this vlog. Um, and yeah, so that is pretty much everything. I am a little bit bummed because I really wanted to get um, some orders out today, but I have been really underestimating the amount of time that the sticker albums take to make. You guys saw a little bit of footage of me doing that in yesterday's vlog and in today's vlog, but basically you make the stickers and you have to put them onto the front of the sticker albums because the sticker albums are just blank and then you put the stickers on them. And you want to get them like really straight and looking nice. So I don't want to ever rush the sticker albums and like have the stickers be cricket or anything like that. So that process definitely takes a lot longer than I am accounting for. And unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to have time to package any orders today. So we're going to hold off package orders on Monday morning and get the orders out on Monday. So they are going out one day later than they would normally go out. Um, I'm a little bit bummed, but people are really understanding and they know that I'm a one woman show and sometimes things go out slightly later than I want them to. So yeah, a little bit bummed, but what are you gonna do? I need to like figure out a better processing time for those. Um, but yeah, I think that's everything. I'm going to get up. We are going to tidy up the office first and then we'll move into the guest bedroom. And then I think I might run over to like Food Basics or something and try to figure out a little um, welcome basket situation because I don't really have it planned, but we will see. I need to make like a little thing that says like the Wi-Fi password and stuff. I know that's like a cute thing that people do, so. Anyways, without further ado, let's get into this vlog. I still need to upload the vlog from yesterday, so we're gonna do that, clean up the office, and move on to cleaning the rest of the house and working on the guest bedroom. Okay, goodbye. So 
So this is the current situation in the guest bedroom. It is quite the storage room, let me just say. We have like my studio lighting in here. All of this is home decor that was on the shelves that I moved in the um, rec room. And then we have a bunch of stuff there that needs to go in the closet. We got some stuff for my office. Uh, we got some <laughs> cutters that have, you know, retired, I guess. Um, we have a foiling machine that's retired. We got a printer under there that's retired. Just a lot of retired things. And yeah, so I definitely need to tidy up this room, get everything ready for Tom and Asha. Um, I just need to like change the sheets and stuff on the bed, find, you know, a home for all these things. I need to vacuum this. We need to clean the bathroom. So without further ado, let's try to find some homes for these things and then we will go from there. all finished cleaning the bedroom um, I still need to do the bathroom but we're going to the rock climbing gym tonight so I'm gonna do it when we get home but we also are gonna go to either the grocery store or shoppers drug mart to get some stuff for their little welcome basket I don't know if I'm gonna put it here I think that's kind of cute or I could put it over on this table um, which speaking of we got our Wi-Fi and our Wi-Fi password there my little planning setup is looking cute we got the guitar over there which kind of brings in like the bohemian vibes which is cute this wall right here i'm thinking about um painting like a i don't know dark orange color like a burnt orange color or like a brown kind of caramel color probably going to match the upstairs room like the closet slash office room um, i figured i might as well you know use the paint for both here and upstairs but we added some plants looking cute we got a little tray there that's you know useless but cute um and like i said i still need to clean the bathroom but everything is clean and tidy and beautiful looking so good and ready for guests i look like i'm gonna like eat somebody i'm gonna like unzip it's like it's <laughs> <laughs> <That's> terrifying <laughs> we got a new mask guys it's so cute! Alicia made it! <laughs> We're climbing. I, I love how we both we both smile at the camera. You can't see us smiling. You didn't see me smiling? 
I'm still smiling behind my mask. I just my eyes are smiling. Yeah. <laughs> Okay friends, so we are at Shoppers Drug Mart. We just came from the climbing gym and we are buying some stuff for our gift basket. <laughs> gift basket that We're he thinks about. he thinks we don't need, <laughs> but well, I'm being extra. No, it's, it's nice, but the water bottles are extra. <laughs> if they want water, water they want to have it in their room. They won't, don't want to have to go upstairs, you know? Yeah. But yes. Time to get shopping, friends. So we are back from climbing. I also showed you guys that we went to Shoppers. I literally got like one clip from in there, but I wanted to show you guys everything that I got from Shoppers and then we we're going to be putting all of the stuff that I got for the little like welcome basket, guest basket thing. I'm gonna show you how I put that all into this basket. This is my first time doing like a guest basket, so don't <laughs> think that I'm a pro and this is what you should do. Definitely look it up on like Pinterest and stuff. That's kind of what I did. So let's get into the Shoppers Drug Mart haul and then putting together the guest basket. So this is everything that I ended up getting from Shoppers. I wanted to get them some water, some snacks, and then just some like bathing stuff. I needed shampoo and conditioner already, so I figured I might as well get some new ones for downstairs and then when they are done, I can just use them myself. So um, this is not for them. This is just for me because I needed a um, replacement for my deodorant that's run out. We got them this here, which is just a body wash, conditioner, shampoo, and then this is like a hair treatment. I'm just going to put it down there. They probably won't use it, but I will definitely use that. Um, all of these are like made with rose too, and I think the packaging is so gorgeous. They were on sale, so your girl had to get some of these. And we got some... Eaton Path, Off the Eaton Path, Chickpea Crisps. We had these at my parents' house and they were really, really good. So I wanted to get those for them. These are like snacks that we might just end up eating all together. We will see, but I figured I might as well put them in their room and then they can decide if they want to have them on their own or with us. It doesn't really matter. Um, we got some Maltesers. We got some Sour Patch Kid Watermelons and Sour Patch Kids. And then two bottles of water. I wanted to get these like fancy ones so they could either bring these back home with them if they wanted to like reuse them or we could just keep them here and reuse them so yes that is everything now time to put things into the basket okay so i'm gonna put just like two folded towels at the bottoms because i want things to like actually poke out the top i'm just gonna put two towels at the bottom they can be towels that they use or not but it's just to kind of give everything a little, little cushion, you know? So at the back, I'm just gonna put some snacks. We've got the Maltesers and these. Pretty. And then we can put the waters in here. In the center. Maybe a, like a hand sanitizer to put in here. That's kind of cute. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of a better look, but I'm gonna actually put these in the shower when I clean the shower tomorrow. So I'm gonna leave those out and maybe I'll grab a hand sanitizer. Like what else do you need? Guys, I am being so super extra, but I am loving it. So I ended up going around and grabbing a few more things. I have a bunch of these um, like Costco facial towelettes. I don't use them as often as I used to, so I have a ton of them. So I figured 
We might as well put that in there. Um, we have a hand sanitizer here. We bought a bunch of these just to have like in our cars and stuff. And this one I don't think has been used at all. So I'll throw that in there. And then I also have a deep sleep pillow spray, which I love. So I figured might as well give that to them. And then we also have a cotton room spray from Bath and Body Works. So we're just gonna throw those in here as well. And I think that's good. I kind of wish everything was up a little bit more, but honestly, it's good. I'm gonna bring it downstairs, show you guys everything that's inside. Actually, I might as well show you everything. Mm, no, let's bring it downstairs and then I'll show you guys everything. Okay, friends, so I have put it down here. I think I've decided to put it on the bench because this just looks too darn cute. Like imagine walking in to your room as guests. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, anyways, this is just a basket. I'm pretty sure I got this from either Michael's or HomeSense a long time ago. But like I showed you guys, we got some snacks in the back, snacks on the side, the water's in the center. We have the makeup wipes, hand sanitizer, deep sleep pillow spray, and then the room spray there. And then there's two towels at the bottom. Obviously those are just for <laughs> bringing everything up a little bit but they could also use them for like washing their face or anything like that. But yes, I feel so awesome about this. I feel like such a good host. Look at how clean their room is. So anyways, that's going to be everything for this vlog. Hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit of me working, a little bit of me cleaning the guest bedroom and also doing the little guest basket. I had way too much fun with this, but um, anyways, I did get this vlog up a little bit late, so there's only a few questions, but someone asked um, two questions, which I really, really loved both of her questions, so I'm going to answer them. One is, so she started off, hi Jenna, I have two questions for you, feel free to answer just one or none, I'm going to answer both of them, um, but I was wondering uh, if you and Francis had any relationship advice, keeping your relationship happy and in a good place, you two always seem so good together. Oh, that's so sweet. Um, I also wanted to ask, once you do have kids in the future, do you think you would continue to vlog and be a bit of a family vlogger along with your usual content? I love your videos so much. I've been living for Vlogtober. I've been watching you since you were running Planting Roses out of your parents' house, which girl, thank you so much for sticking with me this whole time. I've definitely gone through a lot of changes but that just means the entire world that you've stuck around and continue to watch my content. But to answer the first question, Francis and I have always had a really good relationship. I don't know if he's listening to me right now. Uh, yeah, I'm listening. <laughs> he's over there playing uh, some of his monster hunter. But um, we've always had just a really good relationship. We have really good communication, um, which is like essential when it comes to having a good relationship when either of us are frustrated with one another or you know there's something wrong we talk about it and we don't hold things back from each other so i think that's a really good thing um do you have anything else to add to that uh yeah just after talking to each other it's just uh common knowledge that you're you're always right <laughs> <laughs> so and that's the other thing we always we always, yeah, we always keep things very light, I find. I take life too seriously. Yeah, and we're like, we're best friends, so. Yeah. We, we've always just, like, we get in fights. Obviously, I don't film those. Like, when we get in fights, I'm in a mood where I don't want to vlog. So, you guys might be able to tell if I ever, like, have a big jump in a vlog. It's probably because I was mad at Francis and didn't we're feel like vlogging. <laughs> my batteries are just dead. Ta speaking about my battery, um, my battery's dying. So hopefully I can get through this outro. Dying. It's always dying. Um, but then the second question was, um, once you have kids in the future, do you think you would continue to vlog and be a bit of a family vlogger? I would love to. I don't know if Francis thinks about that and having like our kids on the internet. Yeah. So my camera died. <laughs> but um, Francis was saying that he would, but he just doesn't want to shove the camera in our kids face constantly so it would definitely be like you guys see Penny every once in a while that would kind of be the same thing you'd like see our kid or kids every once in a while it wouldn't be like solely focused on them all the time so 
I definitely think I'd want to. It just wouldn't be a full-on family vlog. You would just see them every once in a while, you know? That is going to be everything for this vlog. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below any questions you have. Um, hit the subscribe button if you have yet to do so. We hit 77.8, so we're almost at 79, and then that's 80. And after 80, guys, we need to get to 100,000, please. That would be like the best thing ever. I would love to get to 100,000 subscribers and it would just make me so happy. So help me out with that by just simply clicking the subscribe button. I'd appreciate it very much. And yeah, I think that's gonna be everything. I love you guys. Remember, you're somebody's reason to smile and I will see you in tomorrow's vlog. Bye guys.